my block prints. I get a good stack. But, um, a few good alright stickers. Some throw ups. And some of those. Whatever, and just a bag, and then some of my old stickers, like my old, old stickers from like a long time ago. And uh, over here, this is a garbage can, a roller for the black prints. Like you roll it in the ink and then, or the paint, and then put it over the print ex itself. Uh, straight edge cutter. This I showed in the last video. Um, envelopes for trades, obviously. And then right here, I got my black book. Just put this on there recently. I finally decided to. I wasn't. I wasn't really sure what I was gonna do, but I finally just put the black book on. I mean, a uh, obey sticker. So this side is all of my stuff, which I'm going to do that in another video, just to show how much I progressed. And then you flip it over, and it's like everyone else says that I've traded with video. First person, John John. I mean, not John John. John 14-6. And then just goes on from there, and I'll show that in another video, too. And um, right here, just some brand stickers. Uh, if you watch that other video... That I had of how to get these for free. If you haven't, if you want to get those for free, go uh, look that up. Um, right here, just some, a poster board for stencils. Then a Pillsbury Doughboy stencil and this uh, like collage I was I was working on, but I don't know if I'm ever gonna finish it because I have a very small attention span. And in here, this is where. All my stickers that I've, almost every single sticker I've ever made is in. It, um, it smells really good, actually. Just, just might as well throw that in. But, um, there's a lot of stuff in here. It's all categorized, so collabs, hello my name is, which I don't even have half these filled. Ones that say swap, um... Etc. Those are just random, actually. Uh, they like kill your television and stuff. Uh, templates. Some of these that I really never did. Uh, some ones that I was like, I printed out once and then I would like copy them. But I only did those maybe like once each. Uh, my friend here, which I he changed his name like five times. But uh, I have some of those if anyone wants them in a trade. Um, some brand stickers, I gotta throw those in there for some stencils. I have an Obey one and this, like, whack spray can that's not even lined up at the bottom. Um, collage stickers, yeah, I don't have any more of those. Presidential campaign, that's out. Scraps, so I just have some scraps in there, which I could actually use these. Um, my character, now there's a lot of different characters in there. There's, um, these. This is my more recent one, and then this is my, one of my older ones, and then I had this one, too. It's a popsicle. I had a lot of characters, actually, now that I think about it. But now I have one that I'm going to settle on and use that the most. But anyway, um, stenciled, stickers that I've stenciled. So, I have like that one, and that's that, mostly of those, and then there's some of these, and um, this big one I did of Obama, that was back when I first really started, um, and I got a crap ton of tags, for what reason I don't know, I have these ones on an Apple sticker, but yeah, all those, so then, um, throw ups, few of those I don't really do uh this throw up anymore because I have a newer one that's ten times better. Um right here bunch of I think this is almost everyone that I've traded with. For some reason I saved a bunch of their addresses and uh, half of them I don't even want because they're toys but I just save them 
in case I need them in the future or whatever. So, so then the outbox, which I never even use, and some that are S and C's because I used to do cap too. Like I would be swap cap, like cap is in like uh, like a water bottle cap, I guess you could say. But then um, I learned that someone else in like the seventies did it and then my friend Lava she didn't have any stuff in there anyway but uh I used to do cap until I like some random kid followed me on Instagram and he puts up like other people's graffiti graffiti and whatever and uh he put one up from like the 70s like when, or it might have been the 80s actually like right, right when graffiti was really like starting and uh yeah, I, once I saw that, I was like, oh, I can't do this anymore because it's just biting. But um, in here now, in this closet, um, notebook that my friend uses. Some, I, uh, um, no, it's not this one, but one of them that I had, my really, really old stuff was in there. And I, uh, you could tell that I've progressed so much in, like, the past year. But, um... We've got these. This is just a binder. And, uh, I've drawn some random stuff in there. Characters and whatever. And then over here, this is, um, this is sticker paper. And then I have, like, doodles. And, um, I'll show you where I printed, maybe. I mean, there's gotta be hundreds here of this one design of this old character and, and then I have a collab right there with my character and someone else's and I never got to cutting them out and uh, I have this one here which I did ac accidentally printed the size of the whole entire page and then some old stuff just random things that I've never cut out throwies and tags and these are pretty sick actually actually no they're actually pretty crappy but they're kind of cool I guess and um some with my uh calligraphy pen magazines and folders and some more stickers whatever someone else's cardboard which I don't even know, but it's pretty sick. I got it was like this first pack that I got. It was from the uh, press of thumb, and he included that. So uh, yeah, that's all I got. I think I'm gonna probably divide this into parts. But uh, if not, you're gonna be watching a thing, or if not, you, and you just watch that whole video. Uh, thanks a lot. So uh, peace.